What's up, YouTube? Reg Fox, if you know me, Star Fox, if you don't, here with another real review. And this time we're looking at Prada Luna Rosa. Now, YouTube, I've had this cologne for a while. Um, I can't remember how long, and I haven't gotten around to it, but you know, I was thinking about it and. There is no reason why I haven't done a review on this guy yet. This is a sleeper. Not too many people give it its props, but this thing smells great. I mean, look how much juice I have left, if you can see it. I've been really putting this thing on its paces, and it's it's one hell of a fragrance. Um, it's great for the summertime, great for this particular time we got going on right now. September. Uh, it's still warm. It was about 90 degrees outside today. Um, so it still was a nice fit. Um, it's a nice little funky, it got a little silver situation going on. The cap is the worst thing about this. I mean, it's a little plastic. If you can look at that right there, it's a little plastic cap. Remove it before use. It's not, it's not nothing. But um, you're not here for the cap. You're here for the juice. And it's one hell of a juice. This is the bottle. It, it, it's real simple. It's a real simple um, package. But the fragrance is really well done to me. When I I, I, I feel like this is an aquatic. Um, people probably would, you know, not agree. But I think it's a real great, fresh laundry smell. Uh, actually, I was in... Um, I was at work, I went to lunch, I went to Wild Fig. Uh, for you that don't know what Wild Fig is, is it's a, what is that, a Mediterranean restaurant? It, it's something that's, uh, it was in East Hills, New York, by where I work. And um, one of the ladies at the register said, you smell amazing. I said, thank you. She's like, smells like fresh laundry, but in a good way. And, you know, at first I was like, fresh laundry, I mean, that's good, but do I want to smell like fresh laundry? I mean, we want to smell sexy. But when I thought about it, it, you know, warm, fresh laundry out of the out of the dryer. You want to cuddle up with it. You want to hug with it. And and, and when I thought about it, I w it wasn't too bad. Let me, let me get this, uh, let me waste the spray. I hate to, but that's the sprayer. Oh, it's fresh great fresh there's a minty scent to it it has a mint vibe in fact let's let's look at um what the notes on this bad boy is let's take a let's take a trip down here and look at the kindle if we can go there we go bob base notes all right so top note lavender orange i don't smell any orange in here but i do smell lavender that's where i think uh a lot of the uh fresh laundry is coming from um, middle notes, you got clary sage and spearmint. There's where the, uh, the, the fresh mint note I smell. I definitely smell that. Now, base notes. Okay. And broxen. I don't know if I said that right, YouTube. Correct me if I'm wrong. Uh, and ambry. Don't, to be honest with you, I don't know what the hell those two things are. But, um, you know, this is a really great scent. This scent to me is everyday casual. You can wear it to work. I mean, it, I think it does great. I mean, great at work. Um, but you can also wear this on a date, a night out. It's not overpowering. Um, I, I'm smelling it in the car right now. It's it's really a great scent, YouTube. It's really a great scent. I mean, I know I'm supposed to be reviewing this, but I don't know what to say other than it's one hell of a great scent. And uh, I definitely recommend it. You can find it. Uh, Macy's, I believe, uh, got 60, about 70 bucks for this. And this is the uh, 4 point or 3.7 on the 4. Let's see if it says it here. No, it doesn't say it. Um, but it's a really, look at, look at the much, as much juice as I've used. This is a daily driver for me. I don't think it would fare well in the, in the colder, in the co colder weather. Um, but right now especially for summertime, springtime, and early fall, I am definitely will probably be wearing this until October. Uh, I'll tell you that right now. So that's Prada Luna Rosa. I apologize for the grainy video. I'm recording this on the iPad. We will get back to the high-quality, high-definition videos. But I did want to put this out there. Um, again, this is the... 
the notes on here. Let's zoom that in. From bass notes, it's got 3.5 rating, based out of 40, 54 reviews. Masculine production since 2003. You guys can pause the video, read this for yourself. Um, but it's it's one hell of a fragrance. I, I like it, and they got some prices here. Uh, Scent Monkey 65 seems to be the cheapest place you can get it. But you know, shop around online. Let's take a look. This person gave. Let's see what some some of these people are giving it. This person gave it uh, okay. Uh, minty opening with a hint of ozonic notes. Eh. Hold on, YouTube. Let, let me get this right. Let's let's get that in there. All right. Pause that read for yourself. I, I don't really like when people do the long reviews. This is one of the more interesting. Yada yada yada. So what's that? Thumbs up. Uh, Cologne 65 gives it a thumbs up. Prada Luna Rosa is a good fragrance scent that lasts for a while when wearing. Good choice. It definitely lasts for a while. Uh, this gives me about hmm, YouTube. I would say six to f five hours on my skin. Uh, I stopped smelling it, but people around me still still tell me I smell great, and they still smell it. So it's there. Uh, this one is a little too generic for me. No originality on this Prada Nice bottle, though. No disrespect to the younger crowd, but they might like this one. And that's from SJG3838. I, I don't agree with them. I mean, the younger people def. I don't know. I mean, everybody has their own opinion. Let's see what uh, Johannes from Norway. Breezy, elegant, Swedish. Very carefully balanced. I get an impression of very understated candy and herbs. Herbs almost touching on tobacco. I don't smell tobacco at all in this. Very subdued. I understand why some find it bland. But if you want some pleasant sweetness, this is not greasy, cloying. Yep. All right. Plain? I don't see it. it. I mean, simple. It's an everyday driver. You can wear it at work. You're not... It, to me, it's one of those things, YouTube, you don't know what you want to wear. You don't want to be too strong. You don't want to, you know, pull out the heavy guns. You don't want to go beast mode on anybody. You want to be cool, calm. This is a very airy scent. When that wind blows, people will smell you, and you will smell good. Period. The end. You will smell good. I'm hard-pressed to find anyone that does not like this fragrance. Every woman I've asked, they thought it was great. They, they thought it was clean, fresh, out the shower fragrance. I like it. You probably will like it too. All right. You can't go wrong. I mean, it's not. It doesn't stink. There's just nothing that stinks about it. Let's uh, take a look at some more. Fresh and clean, citrusy, bitter orange plays nicely with the lavender. Citrus dries down to about thirty minutes for. To form a soft and relaxing lavender bubble. I can read, guys. I'm not Floyd Mayweather, even though that's the champ, and he definitely can read. But uh, I'm looking through this. I'm looking at this through the through a different lens. You get it. Mint is almost oh shit Im impeccable, but is but is there keeping the whole structure fresh and clean? As one woman said to me, it's the kind of fragrance that makes me want to smell your shirt when you leave. That makes perfect sense. Again, I just had a Floyd Mayweather moment, but hey, sue me. I thought this was funny. I said it smelled like laundry. That guy's doing laundry. Anyway, I digress. <laughs> All right. I mean, you know, I took a look at the, um, you know, you can go on base notes yourself. Um, you know, I think it's a great, great uh, fragrance. I like it, YouTube. You'll love it. Um, and I really, I really like this one. I think it's a great job. Getting dark, the light went out, battery's dying. So I'll end this video now. Wretch Fox, if you know me, Star Fox, if you don't, shout outs to SJG33839, shout outs to Floyd Mayweather, shout outs to everybody out there, all my fans. Hit the like button, subscribe. Love you, Wretch Fox, if you know me, Star Fox, if you don't, I'm out.